Hi, Will Addison here with my mate Josh. We're just up at my family farm in Cumbria, looking forward to a good day out. We're quite fortunate to play on Friday games most of the time, so it gives us the opportunity to do something with our weekend, and I love to come home. Three years ago we had a little pre-season event and we had 50 of the guys and staff up here and we camped out and then had a good little stint in the village pub. It's nice to get away from Manchester every now and again and uh, yeah, experience what farm life's like. Just trying to make an escape. Good girl. Oh, what do you want? Played for North England under 18s and there's four of us in that team, myself, Will, Ross Harrison and Mark Jennings. We're all in the cell first team squad now, so it's quite a kind of good good crop for us that I've made it through that. Yeah, it's, it's like not... some of your ex-girlfriends maybe. <laughs> Friendlier than that. <laughs> <laughs> to be able to play Premiership Rugby week in and week out with, with those guys, it's, it's extra special. Charlie Hodgson said to me in the past that you can see what we're trying to build now and it's very similar to what he had 10 years ago when we won this competition. It's a team that we all supported growing up. It's our local Northwest Premiership club, and we know we're playing for ourselves, each other, and, and the club as well. Yeah, it looks like a standard front row, to be honest. <laughs> Pretty similar in looks. You know that if you're playing well regularly, then you're in for a shout in, in terms of international selection. And I've shown out myself and Mike being involved, and then obviously Tommy Taylor last year. I do get jealous, yeah. I am constantly asking Josh questions and Mikey questions about what they do day to day and what I need to do to, to be there. Now they've had that taste of international rugby, it's something I desperately want. You know, it's certainly a step up which is going to be at that level, and the more we can try and integrate that into our sales training sessions, then you know, we can push ourselves and uh, be better as a team. Come on. <laughs> Josh, you're going to have to help her the love. Come on. That's it. That's it, that's it. Oh. A lot of us have bought into and signed new contracts because we want to achieve something not only for the club but as a group together. The club's ambition is finally meeting our ambition. I think we could all buy into the fact and see where the club wanted to go so it was kind of an easy decision for a lot of us. Playing uh, with each other is one thing but also playing for each other is a massive thing and we want to we want to achieve something together. It's very much like a defensive system this. Mike Forshaw will be proud of what we're doing at the moment. Come on. There we go. <laughs> Well, accidentally, I think you've got the best footage of the day there. So. <laughs> <laughs> you see it every day in training, the amount of talent here, and it's just kind of up to us to keep pushing ourselves, getting better, and, you know, hopefully with the more experience and the more exposure, then we'll only keep improving. Dimes gives uh, young players a great opportunity to play, but we've not only got that, but we've got the, uh, the finances to bring in some more established, experienced internationals, and hopefully that blend of uh, youth and experience will, will get a success soon. We've had a mixed start to the season and I think we're just waiting for kind of that one performance where everything really clicks and the more we play with each other then the more that will um, become realistic.